What's up, guys? This ASMR is going to be a little different. Because I'm still going to talk. I love to talk. But if you haven't already, please hit that like and subscribe button, guys. Okay. And also hit that bell notification. So, every time I upload a new video, you will get a notification of that. You will know. This is my favorite snack to have. I love the cheese nacho Doritos and the Cool Ranch is definitely my favorite. I love it. I have to grab some bad news to tell you guys. I told you that I'm in a comedy group, right? And, um, we actually entered into a Doritos commercial. But we didn't make it. We didn't win. But we're not letting it stop us. I mean, you can't let it stop you neither because you're not going to get everything like you want. Sometimes you have to fail to succeed. Leave me some comments down the bottom, guys. Let me know if you like this video. But that's what's unique about everybody's channel is not the difference. It's not the same. That's what makes people channels unique. They do their own thing. That's the second part. I love looking off my fingers.
put my tray over the uh, so you guys can see my sauce. So. Oops, sorry. Did anybody go see the Marvel movie, um, Dark Phoenix yet? Let me know. Okay. I definitely want to go see it. Hold it now. I'm actually gonna be in a movie called The Gateway. Mm. Olivia Mung and Keith David is gonna be in it. Frank um, Rilla. I'm gonna be a pedestrian. And I wanted to sing that. And the other thing, I was a church goer. So, I got a little small part, but it was in a feature film. A lot of big time successful actors like Samuel L. Jackson Keanu Reeves for actually the movies I don't know how big they made it I remember I was watching an ASMR by um, Miss Bella. She does good ASMR too. But everybody knows that ASMRs is like about sound relaxing sounds and stuff like that. So I was on there and I was reading a comment. I 
know somebody was like, can you please stop pouring that Sprite like that? Um, excuse me, that's what this is for. This is about sounds. Relaxing sounds. So, she can pour the Sprite as much as she wants. This is just a lot of hate on here. Like, I don't get it. My favorite bar. Guys, I want to thank you so much for joining me. So there. You just um uh... so I hope that this video was really soothing and you like the sounds and everything. But if anybody and I know some of y'all know. I know some of y'all know because this was even in the news about the um, spam calls and the robot callers. If anybody knows anything that I can do so that I can block this or whatever, please let me know. Please let me know in the comment section. This is really getting ridiculous. I'm tired of them calling me. They, they don't say anything. It's just a robot caller. They'll call you. You'll answer. I don't say nothing because it says don't say nothing. And then they just hang up. And they call every day. Every day at around 2 to 3 p.m. They call every freaking day. And I'm just so tired of it. I hope that somebody out there, um, you know what I'm saying, that uh, knows about this stuff. You know, any kind of TV people, TV reporters that have reported this. And I missed out on it. 
you know, can you please leave me a comment down the bottom, somebody, because I really need these people to stop, or this robot stuff to stop calling me. It's getting on my nerves. It's ridiculous. Like, they ain't got nothing else to do. And I know it's behind somebody, like, just, I know it's behind some type of company that does spam calls, but I'm just really sick of it, guys. I'm sick of it. I'm tired of it. And if you can please give me some advice of what I can do about it, please, I would love it. Please leave me some comments. It's crazy every day. And they call it, they must have it programmed into whatever system they're using. Because I know this is behind some type of company. And I don't know why they picking certain people or whatever. Because I know a lot of people that don't even get those calls on their phone. So I don't know if they're picking specific people to do this to. I don't know. But I know at... At each time, they must program it in there. At each time, at around 3 o'clock. Hold on, let me see what time it is. Yeah, around 3, 3 o'clock to 4 or 2. That's when they start calling. And it be 703 numbers. It be 609 numbers. And, um, like, I used to live in New Jersey, so. Sometimes I answer those numbers. So I'm thinking it, it might be one of my friends. I still have friends in Jersey. They don't say nothing at all. It just hangs up. So I don't understand. What is your point? Like, what are you trying to get to? To make, because this is like really dumb and retarded. Like, who's ever doing it? I'm telling you now, you're really dumb and retarded, and you need to get a life. Because I know it's a, some kind of company or so, even some kind of person behind this. So, whoever is behind this, you're very unintelligent, and you're very stupid, and you're very dumb. To just have some uh, robotic um, piece of machinery to just call people, random people's numbers and hang up. That's so stupid. That, see, the thing is, guys, these kind of people that don't have no life and they sit down, you know, and they do this stuff. They got tired of doing it themselves. So they got this robotic, you know what I'm saying, device so that the robot device can do it. And they, they can sit there and laugh all day. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what they do. They sitting down in their chair or probably in bed and they put this robotic thing and they just call, you know, random numbers all day and they just laugh because they was tired of having to do it themselves. So they found out a way that they could get robots to call you all day long and say nothing and hang up. It's just so freaking dumb, un unintelligent and stupid. Like, find something to do for your life. Stop. Find something that's you know, some nourishment for your brain instead of doing dumb stuff all that. I don't get it. I could see if it was once out of the blue moon, but they doing this every freaking day. Every day. I don't get it.
Mm-mm. So, guys, oh, man. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining me. I love you guys. Always thinking about you. This is my first S ASMR video. I'm so freaking excited about this. You know, guys, come on in, come on in and view it. Come on in. I would like to see other people do some Doritos and some salsa. I've seen a lot of uh, SMRs, but I haven't seen. I don't think I've seen one. Maybe I missed it. If I did, let me know. But I haven't seen anybody do a Doritos and salsa. So, you know, I want somebody to do it. I'm highly requesting that you do this uh smr with doritos and a little bit of salsa and a little bit of ginger ale yes but this is my first asmr guys video and i just thought of it up as today you know what i'm saying but i had went to the grocery store and everything i had got all <laughs> my stuff and i was just so super excited i love doritos doritos is my go-to snack I love this stuff. And I should be pretty full for today. I probably won't eat anything else for today. If y'all wondering what that um, blue thing is behind me, that's my friend um, Binky. He's he's um, he's shy though. He's not gonna talk. All he does is sit there all the time with that blanket on. Blinky. So. He said he wanted to meet y'all, but we ain't saying nothing. Crazy time. Thank you. I don't know about it. But thank you so much for joining me. Me and Binky, we really appreciate you guys checking us out or whatever. He was a little bit, um, you know, shy or whatever. Maybe next video he'll come out, but <laughs> I don't know. I can't make him come and talk to you guys, okay? So maybe y'all can say something in the comments and ask Binky, you know, to get him a little bit more familiar with you guys and to bring him out of his shell because, um, He's not really doing nothing right now. But thank you so much, guys, for joining us. Me and Beaky, we love you. We're always thinking about you. Until next time, please stay healthy, safe, and sound.